Hello, how to solve for x and y in this equation? x square minus y is equal to 183. y square minus x is equal to 183. Solution. x square minus y is equal to 183. Let's call this equation 1. y square minus s is equal to 183. Let's call this equation 2. Then, let's subtract equation 1 from equation 2 that is a square minus y minus y square minus s is equal to 183 minus 183 then this is a square minus y minus y square plus s is equal to zero then here we have a square minus y square plus s minus y is equal to zero this is in the form of perfect square if you have a square minus b square this is equal to a plus b bracket a minus b then this can be written as s plus y bracket s minus y plus this s minus y is equal to zero here you can see that s minus y is common let's bring it out we have s minus y bracket if you divide this by this we have s plus y then plus if you divide this by this we have one is equal to zero there are two cases here the first case is s minus y is equal to zero and the second case s plus y plus one is equal to zero but from here we say s is equal to y and here we know that s is not equal to y so this cannot be equal to this so it is rejected now from here s plus y is equal to minus one let's call this equation three Also, let's add equation 1 and 2. That is, a square minus y plus y square minus s is equal to 183 plus 183 then here we have s square plus y square minus s minus y is equal to 183 plus 183 that is 366 then we have s square plus y square is equal to 366 if you take this to the other side, it becomes plus s plus y. But we know that s plus y is equal to minus 1. Then this is s square plus y square is equal to 366 plus minus 1. That is from equation 3. s square plus y square is equal to 366 minus 1 a square plus y square is equal to 365 let's call this equation 4 from equation 3 s plus y is equal to minus 1. Let's square both sides. S plus y 
all square is equal to minus 1 square. Then x plus y all square is equal to 1. Now s plus y all square is equal to s square plus y square plus 2xy. So here we have s square plus y square plus 2xy is equal to 1. Now we know that s square y square is equal to 365 then plus 2 sy is equal to 1 now this is 2 sy is equal to 1 minus 365 2 xy is equal to minus 364 then let's divide both sides by 2 divided by 2 this will cancel this sy is equal to minus 182 let's call this equation 5 then note that If you have s minus y square, this is equal to s square plus y square minus 2xy. Then here, x minus y all square is equal to s square plus y square, that is 365 minus 2 bracket sy is minus 182 from equation 5. Then x minus y all square is equal to 365 plus here will be 364 have x minus y all square is equal to 365 plus 364 that is 729 then let's take the square root of both sides we have square root of s minus y square then square root of this 729 this will cancel this s minus y is equal to plus or minus 27 therefore s minus y is equal to 27 or s minus y is equal to minus 27 then from equation 3 we have x plus y is equal to minus 1 then here s plus y is equal to minus 1 we can now solve the two simultaneously then here let's add the two equations together using elimination method s plus s this is 2x this we cancel this is equal to 27 minus 1 that is 26 now let's divide both sides by 2 this divided by 2 2 year 1 2 year 1 2 year 1 2 year 13 therefore s is equal to 13 this is the value of s now to solve for y Let's use either equation 1 or equation 2, but I'm going to make use of this equation 2. From s plus y is equal to minus 1. Then 13 plus y is equal to minus 1. y is equal to 
minus 1 minus 13 y is equal to minus 14 this is the value of y therefore s1 comma y1 from the first case is equal to 13 comma minus 14 this is the final answer also let's consider the second case here using elimination method then by adding the two equations together s plus s this is 2s this will cancel this is equal to 20 minus 27 minus 1 that is minus 28 let's divide both sides by 2 divided by 2 this will cancel this s is equal to minus 14 this is the value of s also from s plus y equal to minus 1 then we have minus 14 plus y is equal to minus 1 y is equal to minus 1 plus 14 then y is equal to 13 therefore s2 comma y2 is equal to minus 14 comma 13 this is also for the value of s and y from the second case i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel bye